So desperate people seeking flour, anything, any sustenance, considering the fact that they have been left to starve to death. And as they're you know, swarming the humanitarian aid convoy, convoy the trucks, they get fired at by the IDF. So who are the animals? Yeah. Who are the animals, Jenk? Who are the animals? Because yeah. I'm getting real sick of people on social media referring to Palestinian civilians as animals. Because every story that we've covered, everything that we've investigated and looked into, does not really show Palestinians behaving as animals. It shows the IDF behaving as animals. People who feel real good about themselves shooting their weapons at desperate people as they swarm a humanitarian aid truck. I just, anyway, sorry, go ahead. So uh, latest numbers are 112 dead, 760 injured. Um, 576,000 Palestinians are now starving. And this is what starving looks like. Now the Israelis say, or it's confirmed uh, by international news outlets like CNN, that the Israelis fired from the tanks and from drones. And they said they were worried about their troops. Where, where were the troops? Inside the tanks, they weren't in the drones. So the guys that were inside tanks were slightly, slightly, slightly concerned, I guess, about their, this is the best case scenario for Israel that I'm laying out, about their safety within the tank. So they murdered 112 people at least. And when you started firing into the crowd, what did you think was going to happen? Other than the slaughter from your bullets, that hungry, desperate crowd, of course, was going to panic when you started spraying the place with bullets and the trucks were gonna panic. And you knew that that would also create a stampede. 